Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Production YouTube channel. I'm your host, the Honor Greg B, and today it's Friday. And it's time for Free For All Friday, and that's we're gonna open up this 2021 Topps Heritage Baseball Mega Box. We're gonna do part one. There's a lots of packs in these, so we're gonna spread it out over a couple weeks. So uh yeah, but if you missed any previous free for all Fridays, head up there, check it out while you're at it, head on down, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, the thumbs up, like the video, hit that share button, share this with everyone you know. Head over, head down in the comments, I should say, and tell me what your best hit is you've ever pulled out of Topps Heritage. Any year, you know, whatever it is, it was high numbers, regular number, minor league, any sort of Topps Heritage product, what's the best hit you've ever had? And then check out the links in the description for my blog, podcast, other social media, as well as my eBay, where if you're looking for some last minute holiday gifts, go check it out. Maybe there's something on there that you might might interest someone you know, uh, and you can buy it for them, make some offers, buy some stuff. I'm willing to willing to deal so make some offers. And then, um, yeah, save me as a seller and also share it with your friends if you feel so inclined. All right, so let's dive into this. There are 17 packs. There are nine cards per pack. Now, it says, this is the target version, so it says there's one bonus pack containing three exclusive red bordered base cards. Now, I don't know what happened. I think maybe they printed this before they decided, you know what? No need to put an extra pack in there. Just put the cards in the packs that are already in there. So the packs are actually in the card. Uh, the cards are actually in the regular packs. There's no bonus pack. Like, stop doing that. They used to always do that with these products. Have the bonus pack with the parallels. But uh, in the last couple years, I don't know if to save on packaging or something. They've stopped doing that. And they put them just in the regular packs. Um, just as extra cards in the regular packs. So... There are 17 packs. One, two, three, four, five. So we'll do, and let's do seven today. No, what am I, I can't do math. Let's do eight today and nine next week. How about that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we'll do eight today and we'll save the nine, the other nine for next week. Spread it up a little bit. That's a lot of packs, 17 packs. It'd be a long video and I don't wanna take that long. I typically I haven't done super great with heritage just in general not not, not 2021 not you know specifically 2021 just in general I it's uh, heritage seems to be a tough set I feel like if you get something um it's pretty good but the odds of getting something like I think the best I've ever done is got maybe gotten a relic I know I've actually ran, pulled randomly some action variations out of 2020 heritage just random packs it wasn't even like i was opening a box or anything it was just like i got a random pack in somewhere and boom it's you know um it's got an action parallel or whatever but uh generally speaking i haven't done very well because i know you can get hot boxes and stuff yeah whatever we got yandi diaz we got pitching leaders of those guys shohei uh anthony rizzo julio urias Julio Urias, Thierio Estrada, Luis Robert in action, second year to Luis Robert, Nick Castellanos, uh, Gio Gonzalez. Uh, look for high number stuff. Don't see any unless the Shohei isn't a high number, is it? No. And the in action cards are not. I know that. All right, next pack. Pack feels a little thick. Like it could just mean it might have one of those red cards in it, or it might be my imagination. Kevin PR. Pilar, uh, Dylan Carlson, rookie, Evan with Evan White, Andrew McCutcheon, Ronaldo Nunez, Brad Boxberger. We got some more rookies. Make a little rookie pile, I guess. Rookie of the Year Award, okay. Alec, Alec Baum, Spencer Howard. We got Gregory Ponta. And there we go. There's our red parallel. Like I said, that's why it felt a little thick. And it's actually a high number. I don't know if that means anything in, for, like, the parallels necessarily, but maybe? I didn't check the other ones, but... Uh, oh, yeah, the Brad Boxberger is a high number short print as well. All right. I mean, you get the high number short prints. Those, are, those aren't whatever, anything special, but, hey, you know, it is what it is. Guaro Escobar got some more rookies. Key Brian Hayes and Jose Garcia. Let's do... Kind of a, I don't know, like that maybe. Uh, Sean Manaya, Nico Horner, childhood star Juan Soto, uh, die cut. It's kind of cool. Got Bo Bichette, second year card. Clayton Kershaw, 
We got Robbie Grossman, Ed Edder, Edder in Karate, or however you say his name. Oh, those are short prints. Or uh, I never are these either of these. No. Just double checking. All right, next pack. Got Dominic Smith, Austin Slater, Starling Marte, uh, Wilson Contreras. Then and now, Steve Carlton and Trevor Bauer uh, insert. Michael Chavez, Starling Marte in action, Garrett Cole, and Randy Dobnak. Uh, let's see if any of these are high number short prints. I don't, they're not. I feel like typically if you're going to get an insert, you're probably not going to get a high number short print, but I don't know that to be necessarily the rule. Um, so you always got to double check. We got Rick Porcello, Brett Anderson, Eric Thames, uh, Daniel Hudson, Tommy Hunter, uh, NL ERA leaders, Ronald Acuna Jr. in action, JD Davis, and Joey Wendell. Let's see if we got, yep, Tommy Hunter is a short print. So put that up with the other short print. All right, next pack. Got Justin Verlander, Gregory Soto, Adam Hazley, Adam Ju uh, Adam Judge, Aaron Judge in action, Jorge Alfaro, Albert Pujols, uh, Jose Ramirez in action, Devin Williams, Gold Cup card, and Danny Jansen. Let's see if any of these are high number. Uh, is this high number? Is this high number? Nope. All right, a couple more packs to go. Like I said, we'll do the rest next week. Actually going through this a little faster than I thought I was going to. I mean, it's still a lot of packs, but got Jackie Bradley Jr., John Lester, Jacob Junis, uh, Brady Singer in action. That's a rookie. Uh, Will Myers, Adam Eaton, Miguel Cabrera in action. Future Hall of Famer for sure. Get him, get him on in here. I uh, got Cody Bellinger. Uh, World Series game one and Mookie Betts. So back to back Mookies there, uh, and one of them being the red variation so let's throw him over here any of these high number of short prints no they are not all right last pack for today like i said come back next week we'll finish off the we'll do the other nine packs we should get one more red since we're guaranteed three reds but hopefully we can find some other cool stuff uh we got ronald acuna jr to go along with the other ronald acuna jr that's not a high number of short print or anything uh martin perez we got luis garcia in action rookie card we got roberto clemente the great one parallel or not parallel insert set ty france trent grisham uh postseason al postseason charlie blackman and rio Ru rio ruiz and uh the ty france is a short high number short print so there we go uh yeah that's gonna do it for today for free for all friday for today we did half the box of this mega box and again, come back next week. We got nine more packs to go from this 2021 Topps Heritage Baseball Mega Box from Target, specifically from Target. I know Walmart had a different version. I think, I can't remember. I think, mm, I'm trying to remember. I know there was like a different insert because I mean, our different like special exclusive because obviously Target's got the red cards. I can't remember what the Walmart version had. I don't know if I have any Walmart versions. I don't think I do, but I feel like they had something else. But whatever it was, I don't remember. Uh, let me know in the comments if you do. But uh, regardless, uh, we'll finish off this box next week. Um, but come back next week. But come back every day. I have videos posted every day, sometimes multiple today, like earlier on today. I had a Mystery Friday video. Go check that out if you missed it. But uh, just hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. You'll get a notification every time the video is up. When you watch, come over, watch, like, it, share, comment, and all that fun stuff. Keyword there. It's fun. Just having fun here on the channel. Opening up cards, talking sports, getting you ready for the holidays, and all that goodness. Um, so, yeah. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Stay safe. Have fun. Talk next time.